Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 570. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel and click on my college website link and you can download the workbook, Magic Trick 570 to 574. Hey, uh, we have a data set here and we have some duplicate records. So we have one duplicate set here and one duplicate set here. All of the elements in this record are the same as all of the elements in this record, so it constitutes a duplicate. Here we have a duplicate in this particular column, but that doesn't count. It's the actual record we were interested in. Actually, this trick uh, was sent in by Earthworm82 from YouTube. Um, we're going to use a feature called Remove Duplicates. came in 2007, and it's still here in 2010. You highlight, and actually, this method is going to permanently alter the data set. So I usually copy and then paste it somewhere else, just in case I get into trouble. Then we go up to Data, Remove Duplicates. Now, you can choose which columns. If you select just Sales Rep, it would remove uh, one of the SRs, one of the SR2, one of the SR3, and one of the SR6. But we don't want that. We want to check the entire um, record here. Because we have all of the fields selected, it will only remove two records, the two duplicates. If we had just sales rep, it would remove three because there's one other additional duplicate in the sales rep column. All right, we want the record, so we sit, click OK, and just like that, it removes those two records. All right, we'll see you next trick.